Talk about a cruise ship nightmare. I felt like it was definitely a super spreader event. Ashley Peterson set sail aboard the Carnival Freedom bound for the Caribbean. Footage shows lively passengers, some not wearing masks, excited for their dream vacation. But two days into the cruise, Ashley says passengers suspected a COVID outbreak when crew members started isolating. This photo shows a worker dressed in a hazmat suit. Ashley says this hallway was shut off for COVID quarantining. It just felt like a petri dish that we were just kind of all there being exposed to COVID. She says COVID was finally confirmed when they were denied entry into a port in the Caribbean. That was the first time that they would um, admit that there was COVID on the ship. Carnival tells Inside Edition, a small number on board were isolated due to a positive COVID test. That wasn't the only cruise ship hit by the virus. At least six cruise ships have suffered COVID outbreaks, which led to thousands of passengers being banned from touring certain popular destinations. Austin Hamaway believes he has COVID after cruising on the MSC Seashore, which has reported at least 28 COVID cases. I have a sore throat and my brother started with a sore throat. The travel vlogger says as soon as they boarded their cruise to Mexico, he had concerns. In the dining room, it's very crowded. You're sitting down, all the tables are in. The elevators are very crowded. They were jam-packed. I was a little shocked by how crowded everywhere was. The cruise line says they were booked far below capacity. And these passengers on a Holland America cruise were banned from touring Puerto Vallarta after the cruise line says a small number of its employees tested positive. We were waiting for about an hour to get off. They kept saying we're delayed, we're delayed, we're delayed. And finally, the captain got on and said, we're leaving in an hour, we're not getting off. That some of the crew caught COVID. 